Hey. <gasps> I need to wash my bed sheets. Also, I need to water a lot of my plants because a lot of them look like her. So. Yeah. Yeah. I don't really have a lot of energy, but I'm kind of like, when I get to a point of exhaustion, my body starts to create energy that's not there. Okay. The lighting situation, like, I would like for it to get better. But can, I don't know that it will. Cause, mm, I'm not opening that one. It's hot outside. The last time I washed my bed sheets was probably a month ago. And that's, I'm not gross. They just haven't been washed, okay? I'm not committed enough to wash my sheets once a week. That's just too much. I want to share something. I want to introduce y'all to a friend I have called Clean Sensations. Oh! If these aren't on my clothes, love, I don't want it. These are going to make my sheets smell delicious. And I'm really excited. I was gonna get burnt, but I'm pretty sure it was vomit. Ew, why do I look like that? I don't like how I look sometimes. <laughs> I think I look really boxy. Today's fit of the day is giving very much rectangle slouch. Unpopular opinion, I used to really hate Cheetos. What I was talking about before was over the course of the summer, I filmed a lot of videos like in a short amount of time and I got pretty comfortable with the camera again. And then I edited all those videos and I didn't have to film for a long time. I feel like I'm having like a readjusting period. In all honesty, I have a really big issue with feeling invalidated by numbers. I'm completely aware that that is an issue that needs to get like resolved because it's unhealthy. And I always ask myself, like, do I really like doing this? And yeah, but then I always feel invalidated by the numbers. And then I feel like I can't film in front of other people because I don't have the numbers. Impress people and it's really not a good headspace to be in. Anyways, thought I would share. Why is it so dark? Probably because I don't turn my light on. <sighs> yeah. Anyways, I thought I needed to, to share right now. Let me take this off because it looks disgusting. <sighs> I'm having a lot of feelings right now. And I think I need to, oh, I'm out of breath. I'm having a lot of mental issues right now with comparing myself to other people and i feel as if watching ew this sounds really narcissistic i think i can i i think i'm gonna watch one of my own videos to like remind myself who i am and that i can be my own person and i don't have to compare myself to other people's videos and try to become them i just need a little bit of self-validation okay i don't feel like i have to watch my own video anymore because that emotion that assisted me I'm just gonna put my glasses back on and keep watching YouTube because I'm bored. I could be cleaning my room or watering my plants that are on the verge of death. Anyways, I don't want to. So, I'm gonna keep watching YouTube. Guys, I'm thinking about doing something really monumental. Before you say it, no, it's not doing my homework. Although, yeah, no, it's not doing my homework. I'm not doing my homework right now. As a lot of you may know, or why does this, ew, why do I sound so formal? As a lot of y'all might know, I navigated away from pet content, like beginning of the summer. <sighs> like after I took my break, I made the executive decision to stop making pet and animal educational related videos, okay? So since then, some of y'all might see where this is going. A lot of the biggest videos on my channel are 
my pet videos. And obviously that's not the direction I wanna go anymore. So, I've been contemplating this for a really long time, but I think I'm gonna go through in private some of my pet videos. That's really insane. I have 68 videos on my channel. The, on the, the only thing that's been holding me back is that if I... <sighs> If I private these videos, a lot of, um, a lot of my watch hours have come from these videos. Like, my video about how to switch your bird to pellets has, like, 8,000 something views. And a lot of my watch hours have come from that video. And if you don't know, to be monetized on YouTube, you have to have 1,000 subscribers and you have to meet 4,000 watch hours. he's in there doing a lot of my watch hours have come from that video so if it gets privated poof there go those watch hours but at the same time i don't want to make pet videos anymore and i don't want people to think that i make pet videos anymore and i want people to subscribe for me for my vlogs i don't know i'm really scared to do it i feel like it's really gonna benefit me though but it's such a big thing like i'm embarrassed by these videos if we're being completely honest i am embarrassed by these videos and the only thing holding me back from privating them is like i said the watch hours in what world was this a good thumbnail in what world is that cute let me answer that for you no world none i can make myself cry see it okay anyways add is its finest yeah i think i'm gonna private them ah! that's so monumental of me I don't know if y'all completely understand how monumental this is for me, but I feel like you do I think we're gonna do it okay maybe let's maybe let's start with like a less lesser video I forget that this video even exists so I don't think I'll miss it fun fact also really really sad fact no but for real <sighs> when my apnea was at its peak at its worst i used to heavily facetune my thumbnails to where my skin looked fake and you couldn't tell that i had awful skin i just spent an embarrassing amount of time taking the thumbnail picture <laughs> Am I gonna include that? Probably. <sighs> oh. Look at him, oh my goodness. Look at him, he's such a celebrity, oh my gosh. I really am gonna private these videos now. I didn't just take a thumbnail to procrastinate, okay? Actually, I think my sheets are done. I just had a bit of a panic attack. I'm not even gonna lie. I got really scared. I just deleted a video that was like halfway uploaded and had been for like three years. And at the top of the screen, a message came up that said, deleting videos, plural. You can leave this page while you wait. And I was like, is it trying to delete all my videos? And when I tell you my heart is still beating extremely fast, I was scared for my entire channel. I was terrified. I'm not even lying. Oh my God. <laughs> That scared me so bad, but we're fine. It only deleted the one. <laughs> Anyways, here we go. This is the last one. This is my most viewed video. Ooh. Got it. One, two, three. <laughs> oh my gosh. I can't believe I just did that. I feel liberated. That's the end of an era. Uh, Pet Care Layton is officially dead. And might I say they smell delicious. I wish I could smell these through the phone right now because they smell mm, divine. Also, I just spent about an hour and a half editing the thumbnail for this video. So you better like it. You better like it. Sorry, that was gross. Anyways, let me be a woman. Woman, woman, woman. Does anyone else do that? When you take out the dryer thingy, I like to go and get the lint to come off. I think it's really fun. <laughs> Yummy. Sorry for being in my bed this entire video, but I'm bringing realism to the channel.
Okay, I have a uh, history project, a journal. I already told you all this. I'm gonna tell you again. And questions, uh, like open-ended reading questions. And I need to answer. <sighs> and I don't want to. You know how senior-itis is a thing? I have junior-itis. Also had sophomore-itis last year, because last year sucked, literally sucked butt. And then this year isn't too much better. Actually, this year is a lot better, I'm not gonna lie. Usually junior year is everyone's hardest year, but last year was so bad because of COVID and everything that I don't, like this year feels slightly less bad. If this is my motivation level my junior year, I'm really, really scared to see what senior-itis is gonna do to me next year. I'll do it tomorrow. I, I, I can't. I can't. I don't have the motivation today. Mom! Yeah, I right now. Can I drive and go pick it up? What do you mean, we'll see? to jam out to his music. I do. Hey. We might be getting hibachi and I'm so excited. Hey y'all, so the world freaking hates me right now. I was getting really excited to film in the car and show y'all some music and stuff. And then I have brought some tape and taped this phone to the dash. Oh my gosh, look at the freaking sun. What the heck, that is so pretty. See that? Hello? Hello? Oh, she's going behind the trees. Girly, what are you doing? What are we doing? What are we doing? Can we like speed it up a bit, mom? What the heck? I'm just trying to vibe! Ah! Like, oh! I want to press this horn so bad. Yes, please go. Please go. Can we speed it up a bit? Can we not? Three miles an hour. Sorry, my road rage is kicking in. Get off my butt, please. What are you doing? Get off my butt. Pass me. Dang. I know the person behind me is getting irritated, but oh well. Anyways, let's listen to a song while y'all watch the underside of me. It's gonna fall when we do this. Watch. Also, bag secure. Social anxiety was still like kind of thriving, but anyways, uh, social anxiety was still like kind of thriving in that moment. But it's okay. I have to pee. You made me miserable. There we go. All right, let's go jam and drive home. Why is the steering wheel like this? Uh, why is it so hot? We're just gonna jam and vibe. Where do you guys 
gotta be. He just whipped through two cars, like. Anyways. Oh, people watching. Yo. Yo. They met in class for metaphysical philosophy. And I'm happy for them. But I Debut to the channel with her Pogue Black t shirt. <laughs> Toby, quit! Love the <laughs> That is so insanely crazy of her. Kelly, why are you watching this again? No. Anyways, we got the food. I've been sitting here eating for a little bit. Uh, I think I'm gonna end. I can't tell how close I am to the camera. Thank you for coming along with me on my jam session. Um, I hope you had as much fun as I did because, quite obviously, I had a lot of fun. Also, my road rage session was kind of extreme but um anywho i had fun nonetheless and i hope you did too comment down below if you want me to do more drive with me that will uh further solidify the fact that i need to buy an actual functioning car tripod instead of trying to make my own i think that's it all right make sure to subscribe girl why are you shaking your salad right now stop it's mixed enough make sure to subscribe to the channel it's free and why wouldn't you and i love y'all and i'll talk to you in my next video Bye! Mm -hmm.